What's up, what's up, collective? I hope everybody's having a beautiful morning, afternoon, wherever you're located. Hope you're staying blessed, abundant, warm. Um, for the past two days, I've been, you know, not really doing as many videos because I have been back taking clients. Yeah, I know I'm the real deal. That goes off of energy. The past two days, I've been getting the download of they unknowledgeably have meanings about you. And at first, I wasn't understanding what I'm seeing, but God has revealed to me several different scenarios on where these people have come to meet up on behalf of you unknowingly but knowingly do you get what i'm saying y'all can also look at my bio to get a reading done slots are limited i'm at like one two slots a day now depending on what type of reading is done if it's major reading going on i can only do a couple of them and sometimes yes i do have to reschedule the readings and bounce them back and forth because one clientele energy could be too powerful for me to be dealing with another entity for the day. You know what I'm saying? So, work with me. Now, it's, it's the real deal. It's the real deal, y'all. Miss Stampoo is certified. I can check out my Instagram for my certifications because I'm real proud with my degrees and my accomplishments and things. But, you know, as of now, when it comes to spiritual realm and stuff, the thing that I accomplish, I will make that public. So, I just received my neurologistic programming life coach certificate which is amazing because this fits right into it well so y'all check me out on instagram follow me on instagram y'all fuck me show me some love i show love baby but yeah we're gonna get into this Nail check. My bad, y'all. My bad, my bad. Y'all know y'all want to see it. Okay. Nail check. Y'all can also see my nails full detail on my Instagram. I always upload them on them. <coughs> and for some strange reason, when these people link up, they be mysteriously all wearing black. Black dresses, you know, sundresses, black jeans and a shirt, jersey dresses and shit. Mostly black, but this this is all un, unplanned. It just happens by nature because that's how much these people have <clears throat> a hate towards you. They have a desire to see you fail, to see you in need, to see you nowhere in life. And I'm getting at the people that's involved too, like, you wouldn't even believe it. The people that get the downloads to link up and go to these certain places. Look, upside down the empress. You can have somebody surround you that's an upside down the empress. This could be so a friend you grew up with or even a sister. That's the type of energy I'm getting. A sisterly energy. Look this. Eight of swords upside down. They want to see you in bondage. These individuals want to see you in bondage. The lovers upside down. Four swords upside down. These individuals want you to be STD filled. Want you to contract STDs, die from an STD. This specifically HIV or AIDS. They want you in bondage for dealing with a wrong lover. So be careful on the people that you are dealing with. Pray for discernment. I don't care what nobody says. You cannot cover up being a Christian. Yeah, you have Christians and we all are different. But when you talk to your partner, ask them, are you a Christian? Are you a Muslim? Are you a whatever you are? You ask them, are you that? And if they are not that, you don't need to be dealing with them because there is like literally no chance and no hope for y'all ever being together. You dig? Yeah, I'm getting all these upside downs, bro. And I just fix the deck. I'm fixing the deck and I keep getting these upside down. We got upside down pairs of wands. Somebody right now, they feeling um, they feeling like they defeated when it comes towards you collective. This individual feels defeated. 
these individuals have plotted your murder. You were supposed to be a part of a homicide that went viral, a viral homicide that never got closed. It wasn't supposed to ever get closed. Judgment. Can't make this shit up. Judgment. And now it's a judgment upon them. Like I said, these individuals sit down and have meetings on behalf of you. Recently, you have triggered these individuals the wrong way. Look, two of swords just fell out completely right here. Oh, you've been working hard. And you're guarded, you're sorted. These individuals are still sending spiritual attacks. They're using Minecraft attacks, candle magic. They're using all forms of attacks that they're sending to you, collective. And it is not working. It's all reversing right back to center. Like, immediately, it's not working. But you're working hard. And I'm getting that they, they're doing the same rituals now. The same rituals and spells they've been doing the past couple of years. Three. What this is? Empress. Five of Swords. The Emperor. Yeah. These individuals have been living off of your, um... Girl, I just dropped right here what I dropped. Look like three of cups. Let me see. Yeah. Upside down three of cups. They've been channeling your energy to make friendships, companionships, especially with men. They also have been messing with your energy to have, to have companionships with men or women. Take it as it resonates. They have been stealing your energy when it comes to relationships in your love life. So every time like you're about to get into a relationship, these people may steal the person that's dealing with you energy from you or from them and put that into their partners and manifest that into their partners. So if you experience, you know, a great companionship with a male or a female and then you wake up in the morning and things just feel different, that's because these individuals are tapped in. They tap into your love life. They tap in. They do readings on you daily. They search up your horoscope. They check on your social media. They may act. They may try to have dreams about you. <clears throat> These people may want to have dreams about you, like a lot of dreams about you and stuff. They force dreams. They force themselves into your dreams as well. So if you be, if if you wake up in the middle of the night and can't go back to sleep, that's because the universe is protecting you from um some sort of dream attacks, dream tapping in. These individuals know it. But this time around, they're not able to do this. You've recently met someone and they can, this person is guarded. And you could also be dating around. The people that you're dealing with are guarded. So any if they are trying to steal the people that you're dealing with, and you may be a private person and don't post or anything or say who you're dealing with, but these individuals don't have to know who you're dealing with. They can just simply tell their little demon hollows whoever's sleeping with her who's ever making her feel like these cards are saying or this psychic or practitioner is saying she's feeling take these feelings away from this person that's making her feel like this whatever's making this person make her feel like this take this away and then you'll start feeling the difference with your person but your person don't even know the difference but this person that you are dealing with not collective they are very aware that people have been doing something to your love life because you are a very amazing person and they woke up and didn't understand why they didn't want to deal with you no more. They woke up and felt the energy was different with you. And they realized it wasn't you, it was them. And this person instantly started praying. Now, that's why at the beginning, look, the hermit. This person can feel that you um you be being betrayed by people. This person can uh can tell that whenever they make you happy. You 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 publicize in some sort of way. People can tell that you're happy, that this person is making you happy. And this person is aware that until you started making this public that this person was making you happy, they wasn't feeling like this. But since you have started making people aware that somebody is making you sort sort of happy, this person is not feeling like that. But this person is highly protected. This person does have great judgment. Now, because of this, now y'all, look, upside down, three of worlds, this, the three of wands, this person does not have HIV AIDS, this person does not have STD, this is a person, they could have slept around a lot now, but they haven't been in contact with STDs and things like that. Like, this person is clean bodily. 
this person keeps themselves clean. They have great, very great hygiene. They mess with women with great hygiene. We got nine of wands and page of pentacles upside down. Um, this person could have also known that your financial hurdles was coming from some sort of magic. This person has has knowledge that has not a lot of especially on finances and things, energy and shit like that. So this person, look, how you pretty. This person knows, your person knows upside down. This person knows that somebody has been trying to feed off of your energy. This person understands, this person knows. But you may not even know that this person is into this type of stuff. When you had talked to this person about it, um, you know, they could, you can compensate on it, but you don't know they they have much as much knowledge as you know. They have more knowledge than you do on it. These people can re recognize the spells, signs, and sequences. There's certain stuff that was done to you. Look, the fool. <clears throat> this person can tell the places that you hurt the star. Look, seven of swords. This person can tell all the wounds that you have tried to cover, all the wounds that you do cover. This person can see all of that. The star. This person can see who you are, what you are, and they definitely understand why people don't like you. The same sex doesn't like you. If you're a female, they understand why females don't like you. If you're a male, they understand why males don't like you. Your person understand why the same sex do not like you. They understand why the same sex would the hermit you, betray you, set you up, lie on you, deceit you. Look, clean the wands. You stand on business. You stand front for what you know. Now, because of this, y'all, these people sensing this, they can tell that, that you have a partner that is burying you. So not only did you gain a bunch of spiritual protection, right? You, this per you've gained this person's protection as well. This person's spiritual protection. The person you're dealing with. And I don't know, I, was, I don't know, these people knowing that it's your partner, I think they're thinking that your partner is doing witchcraft on them. But your partner don't even know who these individuals is, it's just that this individual that you're connected to, no form of bondage can, can be upon them. Every hurdle that comes against this person, they will break it. This person is very brave, this person is very strong and smart. This person is consistent, this person is stable. And I'm getting this individual may also be self-employed. Let's see what's clear we got going on here. Ace of staff, yep. Your person could also be a gun owner. Like your person not nobody to play with. Look, dead. Your person could have also looked at numbers 13. Your, I ain't gonna, your person has a real, real pay. That's all I'm gonna say. Your person is still alive, but I bought the deck card for them. And your person don't have no new beginnings because they are established, establishing. They are already in their new beginning. Like, that's how they met you and shit. Like, they've been the line. Like, your person been tapping, tapping in. Six of Cups. Yeah, your person been. Here we go. Here yeah, the carry on. Mmm. Your person may not be telling you, but they can have some sort of gang, some sort of gang affiliation. From even even if your person is a lawyer, this person has had some sort of gang affiliation. They got killers they can call if somebody come and fuck with you. And your these people are starting to understand that they having visions, nightmares, and shit. They think they seeing you. They think they're seeing this person hand and stuff in the background of your video. They they see flashes of this person in your videos and shit. And they running your videos and pictures back like, oh, I thought I seen somebody in the back. You did. You seen their energy that's over collective. Like this person has an energy over you, protecting you, and they're not even with you. Look, this person knows you completely. You see, all of these they have a wrong. You see, King. Oh shit. King of staff, queen of staff. Oh my fucking god! What in the entire fuck? Are you kidding me? And I y'all seen me pull them hoes. King of staff, queen of staff in the world. Y'all two were is united by God. Like God did this. 
your person is like definitely guarded. I ain't trying to say it now, but you know how you protected and shit collective? Your person is way more protected than you. You haven't even, you don't even know the protection can get as high as your person's protection. Look, will of fortune, the emperor, mm, mm, mm. And this person may be more financially stable than you know it. Look, though. I got two visions on two occasions. These individuals, I mean, this is females linking up on behalf of you. I'm seeing a male too. This could possibly be somebody's ex. Collect this could be one of your exes. Yep. Turn the cup upside down. Somebody you had um instability with. Somebody you wasn't stable with. Somebody you had it upside down. Turn the cup. Turn the cup to it. <clears throat> Seven of staff, ace of coins. You may be out know, but you still gonna win. And when it comes down to it, this ace of coins, your hand, the money is in your hand with the marriage, wrist break, bracelets, wristbands and shit. It is that job. Nine of cups. You get everything that you ever wanted, and people are seeing that. You may not even be noticing it. You have, may have expressed dreams to these people, visions to these people. You may not have known it, but you're accomplishing the things that they that you've told them that you wanted to accomplish. Look at this. It Page of Clones. Yep, like I said. Listen, these individuals have sat down, right? I'm getting somebody was sitting down eating by themselves, right? And they posted themselves at a table eating. Another said, where you at? This is after you did something collective. You accomplished something. You did something on social media. Maybe you opened your business. Your business got a boom. Something happened for you. Great collective. Or you Maybe you just post a picture. You popped out, posted a picture. And you looking real good collective, right? These individuals didn't interact with the, the content at all, correct? But these individuals, they seen it. Look, the lovers. Maybe you posted a picture of yourself with your lover. Something about a relationship. Maybe your lover even posted something about you collective. But something happened and these individuals decided to link up unknowledgeably. Listen. So this person comes, whoever this person is. This is a female and they came with a child. A little baby girl. They came with a baby girl. When she got there, somebody called her. I guess she told somebody that she was going to meet up with whoever this was that she seen on social media in by itself. Then this other person that she called and told, they like, you know, call and check and see did they make it there, are they good. Then they tell them, yeah, the vibe good and shit. Now they want to come, so they pull up and come. They tell somebody that they up there, right? So now everybody linking up and shit, they eating. But once everybody is together, one person, the girl who came with the baby, she, she, they're drinking, right? She brings you up and say, y'all seen collective such and such and such? Everybody starts putting in their opinions and talking about it, right? But no one can come to a conclusion on how they can beat you. At this point, these people not even talking bad about you. They could be saying like little bad comments, but you're doing so great. What can they talk about? They can't talk about your hair. They can't talk about your nails, your clothes, your shoes, your house. Your children, if you have children, your dogs, your car, they can't talk about anything. Look, like I got the towel right here. They can't talk about you going through the top. Look, oh my God. Why it's stuck on the floor? Okay. You put that shit on the floor on these motherfuckers. Period. The number 16 could be significant. We got the tower. On the 16th of this month, these people could be going through the tower. Very large, the tower. And you see it been marinating on them. This is the tower mom been marinating on them. And it's marinated. This is significant for them. June, J January 16th is very significant for these individuals. I don't know. Maybe this is a day they participated in some very vulgarious acts towards you. I don't know. But on the 16th, something is about to happen for them. Or this can mean for 16 years, they're going to be going through the tower moment for playing with you collective. Look. Yep. Two of Cups. Uniting companionships to gossip, talk, to see. Look, the snakes. The snake on the mouse. On the uh, end of the hand. These people cost up and spending money. They could also stole money from you. Look, Ace of Cup. Now your cup is running over. There's another occasion. It looked like somebody was out of town and somebody flew somebody out of town just so they can sit around and talk about you. 
Whenever you post on, you're not somebody that posts like a picture on your page every day. But when you do, just know a meeting is happening. Look. <laughs> grapevine. Great word on the street. Grapevine. They, they looking, they watching, they lurking. So they all linking up and gagging up and trying to see if, you know, if somebody noticed something more than the other person. Did somebody hear something else from another person? And we can, and this could also be attached to my last reading that I did the other day about they made, they lost their inside man. So this could be that too. Somebody ain't got an inside man no more on what you be doing and how you be doing it and shit. So now you really, really got these motherfuckers on tiptoes and wondering and guessing what you got going on collectively because somehow they, they not knowing shit. They not knowing shit. Little king of coins. You chilled on everything. You cool. You not stressing over money. These individuals can see it. I'm hearing it's nothing. It's nothing to you. Maybe that's what you say a lot. <laughs> it's nothing. For a source, these people have sorrow, sorrowful feelings built up and boxed up. Some may right to these individuals feel like, but some don't feel right to them. Look, full coin. They're trying to figure out how to make money. They sit around and try to figure out how to make money. Nine of coins, but you sitting here, you got all this. You and the nine of coins, they and the four of coins. They got a, a couple dollars left trying to figure out how to invest in it and what you're going to do with it. Meanwhile, your money is in rotation. You are full, full, Can't nothing stop your stability at this point in life. Everything you're doing is for the best of you. Everything you're doing is working out well for you. Everything is just abundant. Look, the higher priest, you're knowing. You know your self work. You're knowing the same things that you're going through. And that's what these individuals are talking about. Look, five of cups. I'm also getting that somebody, uh, they meeting up today. And when some, they doing it, like they coming straight from work to go link up. Because this shit is amazing. Like somebody got some new details. Somebody heard something new. Like somebody made up some new false information or some dumb shit. Like somebody got some fake new information about you and your lover. Maybe possibly who your lover is. And how they know your lover is your lover. <clears throat> Look the wheel of fortune. Or where you getting your money and your stability from. They not think they know. You a king of cups. But you, you in isolation. Your money isolated. Your money cannot be touched. Your finances are secure. Where your money is coming from is always secure. But this is some sort of private investment that is being done. Some sort of private business. Private brand. You could be doing private work. Like, for instance, you could go into a temp agency and you work for a private company through the temp agency. You can't disclose who you work for, which is for a lot of temp agencies and, and a lot of jobs. But wherever you work or whatever you do, it cannot be disclosed and not many people know about it. Really, no one knows about it. Look, ten of swords to a staff. This is something that you could have failed at in the past. And you don't want uh, nobody to know about it. Or you just simply don't want uh, anything to happen that your goodness will be the cost of you happening. You don't want people to know your whereabouts and shit. And I can feel that 100% with that tennis force. You don't want no form of debts, robberies, kidnappers, none of that dumb ass shit happening around you. You've seen shit in the past. You know shit. You don't want any of that shit happening to you because of who you are. You are a the star. We did pull that the star card. So you definitely are a star. Plus that queen of staff and king of staff. You're definitely somebody important. For staff, you and your partner is, but see, your partner is safe to do it with your partner. Your partner is safe to do it. You're safe to do this with your partner. And that's what these individuals know. Your partner can't be touched. And they're, they're realizing that now. Your stability can't be touched. Nothing can be touched. They're realizing that now. They want to put it into whoever this the lover is for you, though. They want to put it into this the lover. They're trying to send some type of magic. They're trying to get some type of message to this person. They're trying their best. Look, like some type of argument about you is going on. Some type of argument with your person and your balance. Or you may not even know your person could be in the DMs or in the inbox and the text messages going off on somebody right now for trying to come tell them some tea about you. And your person ain't going to tell them because that's how savage your person is. They really smack the shit out of you for coming and play with collectives. Look, page of cups. You complete your person. No, you didn't. They didn't pick you. It was many fish in the sea. Your person personally picked you out the fish in the sea and picked you out in the golden cup. You, 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 your person cherishes you. You're very cherishable to your person. You, someone values you now and they realize that they know that. Look, some shady shit. They can realize that someone values you now. Someone loves you now. 
Even if it's yourself or your God, your commitment with God has risen. Look, seven is death. You could be our number, but you're still going to win. Baby, I tell you, that's some crazy shit. And they arguing, somebody arguing on how could they lose their inside man. Why is the magic not working? They do magic on you to make you express your feelings on social media, express your feelings to certain individuals, call family and vent to them. They do commitment magic for you to commit and communicate, reconciliation magic. They do anything in their spiritual and physical power. They also send, like if you have a, a business or wherever you work, they send fake customers in just so you could they could be comfortable and talk to you and just figure out a little bit, even if it's... A tiny bit of information. These people do anything to get your information in. It's guarded. It's too guarded. And nothing is working. They're spending way too much money. It's too much going on right now. And at this point, they want to they, they wanna plan a murder on you. They wanna, they're, they're, they're saying something is about to happen to you. They're trying to speak it into existence. But nothing definitely is about to happen to you. You're protected. You're guarded. You're shielded. And also your finances. I'm, I'm here. And we're going to see about that. They think that they're gonna send someone that loves you. Yeah, they think they uh, they think they're gonna reach your partner, or uh, that your partner is gonna turn on you. Or I'm, maybe I'm getting at the person that you were with. They already told this person something a long time ago. This isn't a new person. It's somebody you've been knowing, and this is why this person is so guarded. Okay, that's making sense because I wasn't understanding how this person knows so much. They are gifted, but this person knows what you've been through. Somebody even came to this person and told this person something about you to try to make this person not talk to you. But you still, you still good with this person. Like this, this person doesn't want to harm you. This person doesn't want to do anything to you. This person want to put you in the Queen of Cups moment just so that all these other individuals can get pissed off. But he, they, the he, she wants to piss off these other individuals that betrayed you and put a false judgment on you collectively. You see that? This individual wants to wants to flex on them. Look, want to show them that your finances are infinite, that you good, that you are the empress. That they know that your person know that they was hating on them, hating on you, collective. Like your person is, is sending taking shots at these individuals. What bossing you? What will be in there for you, collective? You and this person may also start traveling a lot. Look, the devil. This person, I told you, this person is so fucking guarded. Look, the devil and two swords. This person is guarded by the devil. That's fucking crazy. How somebody guarded by the devil? What? Whoever this person is, they run this bitch. And that's why these people, these people could have told this male. If I'm just only getting that this is a male. The number's 15, like I said. This, this this person may contact you the 15th of the month and then the 16th of the month is going to have a mental breakdown or some shit when they see you and this person together collective. I'm this strong. I, I really think I'm talking to the divine feminine right now because I get that. I'm, I just seen it. This is a, 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 a could be a superstar male himself. This is somebody of high value collective that, that you had a friendship or some sort of bond or something with partnership, some sort of something. They went and told this person something like maybe you were trying to set them up, rob them, sell them, kill them, some sort of weird shit they told this person. But this person never did give a fuck about what they were saying because this person don't give a fuck if anybody trying to do anything to them. This person to push somebody's shit back. But you never gave this person that vibe. This person, you, this person is the higher priest. This person can see. This person has knowledge of who you are. This person sees that you are the empress. This person can see what was going on. This person can see that some shady shit was going on, that there was some sort of look upside down, look, some sort of betrayal. This person knew what was going on. And because of this, this person, if you text this person, this person will respond back immediately. This person is actively there for you. This person is there to support you. And that's because this person wants to shit on these other people. This person don't believe nothing these people came and told this individual. Because this individual has... has been prophesied through visions through feelings when with you they see things they can see a halo around you this person can also see angels with you this person can see your protection your, your heavenly protection page of swords this person can see it this person can definitely see your protection and that you are highly protected 
Yes, look, the star. Eight of swords. This person knows that people around you is hating on you because you are a star. These people try to stop your shine. These people try to look good. The number 17, look. These people, I'm getting that these individuals is about to go on a fucking social media breakdown about you now. Whatever's about the number 17, now, 16, they about to have the tower moment that's going to be permanent. 17, the star has come out. It's going to, facts are going to be proven on the 17th of this month. January 17th, facts are going to be proven about something you've been saying. Something going on. And somebody's true feeling is this the moon. Something's about to come out. I'm telling you, a social media rant is about to come out. These individuals, one of these individuals is about to get on social media and go fucking bonkers. And it's going to sound like jealousy. For example, if your partner buys you a new car, this person will be on social media. Collective, collective doesn't even have a driver's license. Collective can't drive. Collective, this is like random shit. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, collective doesn't deserve a car. I deserve a car. I deserve this. I, what does collective do? Collective doesn't do anything. Like, this. I'm, I'm hearing it. This person, and they speak very properly, just like this. What does this individual do to deserve a vehicle? That car was bought with fraud or drug money. Um, this person deals with hood people. That's what it is. They're going to be talking about your partner. So maybe your partner is going to put them in a place publicly. Something is publicly going to be done. Maybe your partner may make a large-ass post and be like, with the proofs that these people have been coming at them with false... Falsify. Oh, it's about to go down. That's all I can say. I can't. I, it's, it's about to go down. I don't know. It's a lot of back and forth. Social media and shit. Look, judgment, balance, justice. We got judgment, justice, and balance. Look, we got blue and red. I don't want to see it, but it look like Chris and Bell's about to link up for you, collectives. <sighs> Swarded and gory. Look, the emperor. I just said Swarted and gory at the emperor. This person got people to hear around. This people got people. This person got people. These people meet up and they're about to meet up on social media publicly. And you're the star is about to tear their ass up publicly. And it's about to be shown who really is the star. It's about to be shown who's really the star. And these individuals know it. They're about to really reach a breaking point. These individuals are about to reach a breaking point. Look. This has been a reason you struggle with your finances. But now you have a new role. Look, you have great friendships, companionships, partnerships. Everything you've lost, you've gotten it right back, collective. And you also need to be saving everything you're getting, all your finances and stuff. Don't be tempted to spend your finances. You don't got to spend it and show people you got it like that. They know you got it like that. They know magic is being done in your life on the daily. And they know that you guard and protect because they keep trying and it's not working. These people can also get people from overseas to do magic on you and it's still not working. Y'all stay prayed up. Cancel out every meeting that is called upon them on you. You pray for the sermon and you set a big blaze of fire. In Jesus' name we pray. I say amen and amen.